fans welcome back to another video this is Z from Santa official so before starting the video I would like to request you to like subscribe and share our channel so friends and fans today I'm going to tell you how to use Microsoft Teams and there's a short review on that most of the people are the new users so I'm telling you how to use it how to arrange a meeting how to join a meeting so here is the home user interface of MS Teams. So what you will find on this home page there will be an activity tab. Any activity yet that you have done before you can just uh, filter the activity by clicking the filter button if there is any record. You can check the chats you have with somebody else and you can also start a new chat if there is some of your connections here by finding out their name, email or phone number or some group if you want to create and it will also show your outlook calendar from where you can find your coming meetings or any meetings in your plan so from here you can also click meet now or you can add a new meeting in the meet now option there will be the direct meeting start like you will connect the start meeting you will click you want to use mic uh, you want to use video you can change the settings anything you want to use like you can use external mic external camera external speakers you can change from the settings here just click join now it will take few seconds for connecting all depends on your connection it is saying your mic is muted okay let's unmute it and then I can talk now as I don't have any people in the meeting so I have to invite people who can join me so how can I join add the people here you can see there's only me I am the organizer and uh, just I have to do is to click share invite could not get the meeting link please try later there might be some issue oh sorry my mistake we have to add the email of any persons just like anyone at the rate of hotmail.com and then share invite okay from this if you want to share the content in the meeting you can add your screens anyone you're using like you're opening some uh, word or excel file just click here click the screen of that file you're using and it will be shared to the our users you can also open your camera you can also click your attendance that I'm available you can also applause give a heart smiley thumbs up laugh or raise hand that sir I'm here you can also do the chat with the people that might be the group chat or you can also reply to the person uh, personally just click here you can do the device setting meeting options okay let's check the meeting open options what's inside the meeting options uh, who can bypass the lobby only me or any everyone we can just uh, do the privacy here who can present if you will click everyone everyone can present and if you will click only me you will be the only one to share anything you like and in the lobby if you want to change the organizer you have to right click or spot so in the lobby you can see the people who are using the meeting or who are in the meeting so I'm leaving the meeting and it is finished so let's go to the home page again uh, so it is showing the meeting history that this meeting started this time it was meeting video it was how much time who was the attendee any file any photo shared in that just we can also delete the chat and it will be deleted from here okay to go home uh, to go to download the mobile app just click here it will give you the QR code you can just click the your store or you can just scan your QR code okay
so that was a really simple way to start a meeting here you can just uh, log in start a meeting share the link or you can schedule a meeting by a new meeting and if you click new meeting it will tell you the title like tech review meeting okay tech review meeting and from here i can click the date time like i will click the time 5 pm date how much minutes i want if i increase the time it will be two hour if i can say it will be all day it can be repeated daily weekly monthly yearly custom and i can also do a message i can also share the location like i am in from pakistan just click the pakistan and after that to share classy ideas okay meeting is done then what we have to do is save now it's creating the meeting there are the meeting options so in the meeting options it will take you to the teams.live.com to get the online version of your meeting options okay is opening that only meeting organizer can make changes as i am the organizer only i can make changes it will take some time to load it out so from here you can also add this to your google calendar like you schedule it out that your google calendar or your hotmail calendar can also know that which time this meeting is going to happen and from here I can just make a reminder for that one and secondly I can copy the link and send this link to the email I like so you can see the meeting is scheduled I can also delete the meeting so after you schedule the meeting it will come in your calendar and you can see from here date time the link open meeting chat who is organizer you can also edit the description so in the setting setting tabs you can go to settings and from here you can change the layout the dark the high contrast and the default version from here you can do the application settings language keyboard accounts privacy notification and the devices that you are using right now so that was all from today's video in some other videos regarding MS Teams uh, I will help you out to how to make or arrange the online classes for the students I hope you like our video don't forget to press like subscribe and share button click the bell icon for further notification thank you